I've said this before, but your service team on Disney Cruise Line can really make or break your cruise. You're going to see them every single night. And it's unfortunate, but if you do end up with a team that's maybe a little slow or maybe not working very well together, it does kind of become your responsibility to let the head server know. And the head server is going to be somebody who's dressed a little bit differently than your service team. They're going to be walking through a larger section of the restaurant. Uh, typically, they will introduce themselves the very first night. Uh, just so that you know who they are, but that's the person you're going to want to let know that maybe, hey, you'd like service to go a little bit faster, um, or maybe things just don't seem to be clicking. Let them know. They really want your experience to be absolutely excellent. That's what they're going to be asking for. Keep an eye out for that. We can argue about food quality and pricing of a Disney cruise all day long, but I don't think that you can deny how refreshing it is to just have that opportunity to change restaurants each and every night. Uh, and have a service team that goes with you that's dedicated to you and making sure that you have a really, really great experience.